Okay, so what we're going to go through now is the one-handed tying technique. It's not called the one-handed tying technique because you're using only one hand. It's because you're using one hand to hold an instrument, such as a needle driver, and holding the needle, and the other hand is doing some of the tying work. So plastic surgeons and some other surgeons use this to save suture. And let's take a look at it. So what I've done is tied, I'm using some yarn to tie around just a block. You can practice this tying your shoe. And so what I'm doing here is taking a needle driver. So let's pretend my right hand here is the needle driver. And I'm just going to wrap my the rest of the suture around my hand. And my left hand is going to be the one doing the work. So I'm holding the suture with my left hand like this and my thumb and my third finger are holding it and it's looped around my index finger so I'm keeping the orientation with the um, end of the suture facing me and I'm keeping the suture as far away from my hand or as close to the tip of my fingers as possible and I'm just gonna loop it around like that around my index finger like that and then I'm going to bring my index finger through like that and bring it around the hole like that. And then I simply tie. And I'll end up in this orientation here where I'm holding it like this and then I'm going to simply, with my index finger and my thumb this time, and then I'm looping the right sided suture around like that. I'm using my middle finger to loop underneath and then around just like before, and then like this. So now I'm going to take this again and loop it around my index finger, around like that, and pull. So again, I end up like this in this in orientation, and just loop around like that. So, and I'm like this again, like this, oh, it's a little bit short, like that. So this hand is just staying in one place, and I'm keeping it around like that. So you can see how you can very easily even use a short piece and finish off a bunch of sutures if you really need to. So that's the one-handed tying technique.